Hello, dear ones. I have a thought about um, clearing negative energies. And, and I had an experience with that last night that I thought I'd tell you about. Um, I woke up in the middle of the night. Oh, well, first of all, I should tell you. I was having trouble with the computer and the, and the phone and all the electronic things. It wouldn't work right. And so, and so I bought three pounds of black tourmaline. It's like a, a gemstone. Uh, you can get a raw gemstone, unpolished, on Amazon or here or there. And it, it, you just like wave it in front of your heart when the computer acts up and the computer starts working right. <laughs> and so, so then I learned that this black tourmaline stone can also be used to clear negative energy from the aura. Okay, And I've been having trouble lately waking up in the middle of the night and finding a lot of negative energies coming in, it seems like, coming into my aura or and then expressing themselves out through my aura and clearing and transforming, right? And it's been a little too much to handle. So I, last night, uh, it happened again very dramatically. I woke up in the middle of the night and I felt all of this negative energy. It felt like attack energy, but it also felt like clearing energy. So I went and got the tourmaline stones, uh, like one pound bags of them that I had bought, and um, I, I placed them in, on the affected areas, and I could actually feel, after a few minutes, I could feel them beginning to accumulate this, this, uh, this energy, actually. It took about a half hour for them to actually get full of energy. And so each time a bag would get full, I would lay it aside to be put it out in the sun in the morning and um, try another bag. And that worked great. Actually, it, it, in, a, in another sense, it's good because... When things happen to me, I wake up in the middle of the night, lots of times I feel a little bit frightened, you know, at the energies. And having something to do about it, it really helps. Uh, there are a few other options. One is um, to, to sit up straight and feel your pranic column energy. That's a very good one. Or sit up straight and feel your heart energy. That's a very good one too. Or your high heart energy. Um, so you can work with crystals. You can work with crystals for grounding. That's a very good way to dispel fear, I feel. And um, this black tourmaline anklets that you can wear that might help. Then there are a lot of other things like aromatherapy, um, essential oils, right? And there are, let's see, what else? Oh, acupressure points. You can work with your own acupressure points. You can use Qigong. Um, you can do that for yourself too. Um, let me think. Um, color therapy. Wear special colors. How about that? Or put them around your home. Color therapy helps. Um, so there are quite a few alternative ways of releasing negative energy and that that and adjusting the aura. So. Um, I just thought I'd mention because things have been pretty intense with the with the energies in June and they're likely to get intense again in July. So it's nice to have a few things on hand. One of the ways to, that I use a lot to help myself um, to get out of negative energy honing. Um, I just sound out loud the feelings that I have no matter how loud and outlandish they may be. And then uh, what I find is that the, it dissipates the feelings. And uh, some call it transforming the, the feelings. And so then afterwards I feel more peaceful. And uh, sometimes I use, you know, nonsense syllables and sing. I can sing sacred songs and I find that also helps to change my mood. But so those are possibilities too.